Let's look at some more Steam pages. Maybe we'll find some good ones. Probably a lot of bad ones. Limit shooter. Very basic shooter. Bish bash bots. Tower defense. Yeah, looks like tower defense. Okay, it looks like a cool one with mining and different enemies. Looks kind of nice. But I'm not that into tower defense. Ooh, bosses. Oh, it's actually a co-op game. Oh, okay, that actually looks cool. Was of Masazia a visual novel? Educational? Yeah, very educational. Vampire's Kiss. Text-based. Infection Freeze. Prologue. Yeah, probably a demo version or something. Is this tactical? Is this tower defense? Strategy city builder. Looks like some form of their billions. Bingo pets. Yay. Neon city climbing simulator. Another version of only ups. Except you climb buildings. So Assassin's Creed without the interesting parts. Ground Wars KDR Alpha. I like the music, but very basic shooter. Souls Spectrum. Puzzle Adventure. Looks like a JRPG. The Turgenev Study. Basic shooter? Looks like a kind of basic shooter. Kids Land. Yeah, mini games. Hexilum. Puzzle game with hexes. I don't get it. The gaps. Stop talking. This is not a movie. Show mechanics. We the people, turn-based war game. Yeah, all those seriously abstract games. Nah. Ghostbuster Spirit Unleashed. Didn't that game already release and failed? Not sure what the actual fun is. Forest of Road Driving Simulator. Yeah, kind of boring. Seventh Guest VR. Yeah, the Seventh Guest is an old classic, and this is reimagined. And if you like classic puzzle games, and you have a VR rig, have fun. Bestial Force Magical Mayhem. Magical Girls. Brawler. One button run? Doing what exactly? Unknown. Drone... Flying Simulator? No. 3D action? Third person shooter. I still don't see any gameplay. First trailer should be gameplay. Soccer Bond puzzle game. Freak Crossing? Comedy puzzle platformer with mini games. Warhammer 40k Warp Forge just came out a couple of days ago and reviews are mixed. Warhammer Card Battler. Okay, not a good start. Looks like a JRPG. Lots of talking. Cat Tetris. Weird. Elon Simulator. Yay! Telephone horror game. Psychological horror puzzle. Forgive me, Father 2. There was a Forgive me, Father 1 that was successful. Looks like a retro shooter, just not very interesting. Folk hero, like loop hero. Um, ro action, roguelike. Action, roguelike, maybe. Hmm, very basic, but could be fun. I don't have time for this. Power Wash Adventure. Looks like a big ripoff of Power Wash Simulator, and it's not by Future Lab. I don't know if I can report this. It doesn't look like stolen assets or anything. Just a stolen concept. Geodepths. Mining resource management. Base building. In a sub? Not really sure what's going on. Or how. <laughs> Galvanic Bride. JRPG? Visual novel? Maybe both. Office fight? Oh, it's one of those. Someone's trying to be party animal or zoo gang beasts. Hunter Nightmare. Horror action RPG with horrible frame rate! El Room. First person puzzle platformer. Those are hard to do. And this one doesn't look interesting. Not really sure what's going on here. Little Dasher. 2D platformer. And a very basic one. Yeah, very basic. Haunted Things. Indie horror game. Too much talking during the gameplay video. Not enough interesting gameplay in the gameplay video. Online co-op multiplayer horror. Way, way too dark. And the environment looks basic. Laser Pitium. This looks kinda nice. Only 10 levels? Ah, 2D shooter. Not my thing. Indie 2D horror adventure. Only at the end of the description. People 
Come on. VR puzzle. Again, write better descriptions. Ashes of Arcanum. Nice name. Looks like very bad UI. Presumptuous music. That sounds very familiar. I think the music is stolen. The music sounds very familiar. I'm going to report this just in case. Let Valve sort it out. Jigsaw. I'll send it to my mother. Elgo. Pew pew. Ne 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 ne. Roguelite survival game. Yeah, it's an auto shooter. I don't know what that means. Oh, classic survival horror. Puzzle solving. Exploration strategy. That's how you write a description. Except the gameplay looks boring and the environment looks horrible. YouTuber survivors. It's a brand grab brawler. Full of people I have no idea who. Neon fantasy dogs? Puzzle game. Goo keeper. And it's a platformer? Doesn't sound right. Doesn't look good. Oh, tower defense is in the name. At least that. But very, very basic. And weird. Rock fantasy? Roguelike. Bullet hell? Yeah, looks like a sh twin stick shooter. Bloody Moon is single player third person shooter, except it looks first person. And basic. Mountain driving. Doesn't look like it's supposed to be chill. Open world driving with nothing interesting going on and horrible menus. Third person shooter and so wobbly. Please don't wobble. Stop wobbling. Very Japanese. Song of Horror, Psychological Life, Crafty and Horror. Okay, it looks nice. Kind of an adventure game. Third person, Resident Evil-like. Where's Kidden? Point and click, atmospheric adventure. Pixelized. Okay. Bullet hell action roguelike. Yeah. At least they're trying to put a nice face on it. And there's base building? Okay. Reviews are very positive. Actually looks not half bad. I might try it out later. Alter space. First person wobbler. Open world RPG. Show me gameplay. UI looks horrible. Say scary games. Good for you. More jigsaws. Ball breaker. Stay away from my balls. Three skies. Very Japanese. Old school. Very old school shooter. Nah. A chess game. Vengeance of Mr. Peppermint. Someone's trying to make old boy the video game. Reviews are positive. But it definitely looks like someone's trying to make old boy the video game. I'm not totally against it, but not really my thing. The Cursed Oasis. Chill exploration game. Okay. Enigma Quest is an immersive sim. Doesn't look like it. I think someone didn't understand what immersive sim, immersive sim means. Replaced. Dark Horror Detective. Visual novel, basically. Boogeyman 3. Psychological horror with a squad gun. Math game? Math game. Yeah, a math game. Past uh, action adventure meta. It doesn't look good. No FMV trailers. Bug Blazer. Idle Clicker Casual. Hmm. Someone else trying to be Vampire Survivors. Only horribly. It's a PvE online co-op horror sci-fi. No mention of actual gameplay. And very little shown. Adventure RPG in Russian. Basic top-down shooter. Don't know what this even means. Life Sim RPG Cozy? A JRPG that doesn't look like a JRPG. Pixel of Memory. What? Oh no, this looks bad. Nephilim. Cyberpunk single player 2D. Social deduction. Okay, doesn't look half bad, but not exactly my style. Escape. Puzzle platformer. Strategy game? No, doesn't look good. Skirmish is local co-op PvP. No video in the trailer. Also basic shooter. Strategy tactics game. 3D platformer Sokoban. It's a weird snake-like game? Not sure what the point, what are you actually playing here. Well, that was a thing. Kind of exhausting. There were some gems in there. Thank you for watching. See you next time. Stay good. Have fun.